Hello guys, welcome to this channel and I hope everyone still in good shape and uh, thank you for watching this tutorial and today I'm going to share a tutorial uh, is based on the question from Ricky and actually he is asking about is asking uh, assistance to to change the name this old name over here Steve and Kathy and to be El Sabe and Andrew I'm sorry if I couldn't pronounce this name and uh, I did already so I give a solution already but some of our friend in here they would like to know and wondering how to execute this kind of design so especially Joy and uh, Jean Elena and uh, Fernas Firos and some other friends who are wondering uh, for those who are not yet familiar how to execute this kind of design and I'm, I'm happy to do this one and with my pleasure and um, I hope after watching this tutorial you guys can make it and this is mine that I just mentioned that I give already and I did already and so I give already shadows and I changed already the name so how I do how I make these things so let's go to the next page so this is all the name of element so this phone name is daydream this title of this element is a sign, the sign of infinity. It's such a long name in here, but I make it short. So you just click element and uh, you paste in there. And after that, you just enter it and click graphic. So scroll down, right? So once you, once you search, once you find this one over here, you just try click this one and then it will extend and after you will see the extension in here you just click see all and uh, scrolling down yeah scrolling down and there is here yeah there is here the the sign of uh, infinity so uh, you will just search below and then this is the name of of this infinity in here so I think I believe there's a lot of uh, option in here so it's up to you which one you like so I just would like to give a tutorial based on this based on these uh, questions from here so that um, it will not go somewhere else uh, the story of making this um, kind of design all right so uh, after we got we get all this element in here right so we need to uh, get assistance from this blob this little element in here so the name of this element here is blob you just type b l o b type in here and then you will get this one so it seems like a triangle blob but actually this one is uh, abstract shapes so I need this one I'm gonna let you know so we just change the color become uh, brown so that it's easy for you guys because I want to cut right if I don't put this one in here so it's so ugly you know uh, so I cannot cut directly so I need to use a technique how to give a cut effect in here so I need to arrange yeah, I need to arrange this um, shape in here it seems like giving a cut on this sign of affinity on this sign of infinity so if I change the color become white so it's gone and uh, now as we can see that it gives a space and it seems like I just give a cut effect on this uh, sign of infinity and even though this one all right even though this one in here I change and give a color you need to be aware in here because once you give a cut in here exactly you know I will just give a zoom in here right if you if you notice uh, the lines over here and between this sign and uh, the letters A so it must be exactly right close to close to this uh, close to this phone 
and even though this one so uh, I need a crop to make this one happen so to make exactly cut all right between this so that it gives a space you just turn it on the right position so that it gives a good cut effect on this uh, design and change the color become white now you can see that it give a beautiful space so that's the the best way to execute this this kind of design so I hope you guys uh, can catch all this uh, explanation and I hope after watching this tutorial you guys can make it right away all right after we put all the elements in the in the correct position now we need to download make sure you choose png and then to click which page are you working on and download your design and i would like to change this color i will give color uh, this one is uh, brown right so I'll go back to my library and I will just put in here and edit image and I would like to remove the background and if you like to give a shadow and here you just use a drop shadow and then click once more one more time and give a shadow and transparent and arrange this transparent over here and the, ang the angle the angle of this shadow and done and if you like to give uh, a strong color so you just copy this font over here I'm sorry you just copy this font over here so in order to give a strong font copy paste this uh, font again and put on the top of this font so that it will not fade it all right so guys um, mine is done and I hope you enjoy this tutorial and if you feel this tutorial is useful you may subscribe the channel to support and if you don't like to get any notification from this channel please do not subscribe you just watch the tutorial and that's fair enough Thank you once again for watching this tutorial and have a good one and see you again for the next tutorial.